What's up everyone, Ken Christopher here, and welcome to another episode of Garlic in the Kitchen, Easter edition. Now, over the past few weeks, we've been learning how to cook with eggs and garlic. And today, we're gonna make something truly exceptional. So, today, we're gonna learn how to make truffle roasted garlic and herb deviled eggs. Well, first things first, we're gonna take a hard boiled egg, and then we're gonna crack it very gently because next we're gonna peel off the shell, leaving the hard-boiled egg and the yolk intact. So now that we peeled six hard-boiled eggs, we're gonna go ahead and cut directly through the center, revealing the yolk inside. We're now gonna remove the yolk from our egg, like so, and it's going right into our food processor, leaving the whites of the hard-boiled egg. All right, so now that we've removed exactly six egg yolks from all of our eggs, it's time to add all of the ingredients. So let's go ahead and add some of that light mayonnaise. Let's go ahead and add California roasted garlic. So if you're looking for the ultimate time saver, I highly recommend pre-roasted, pre-peeled Christopher Ranch garlic. You're gonna find it in the retail section of your favorite grocery store. Now let's add our Dijon mustard. We're gonna add some dill, as well as some olive oil. And lastly, we're gonna take that relish that we had to the side and add that in for some necessary zing to our uh, deviled eggs. Now, with all of our flavors combined, we're gonna go ahead and give them a whiz. And as this is my first time making garlic deviled eggs, I forgot one key ingredient, and that's gonna be your white truffle oil. So even though we've processed our deviled eggs, it's not too late, at least I hope it's not, to add our truffle oil to give us that sensational umami flavor that we're all gonna enjoy. Okay, let's go ahead and take our deviled egg and roasted garlic mixture and put it inside each of our egg white little cups. And we are now just finishing putting our roasted garlic and egg yolk mixture into our hard-boiled egg whites, giving us, if not the prettiest, potentially the most delicious tasting roasted garlic deviled eggs we can imagine. So let's go ahead and see what we got. I gotta say, I'm pretty proud of myself for never having made deviled eggs before. We successfully pulled it off, and we have an incredible treat that you and your guests are gonna love throughout the Easter season. Thank you guys so much for celebrating American farmers. Thank you for loving garlic. And as always, go Easter and go garlic.